Сегодня Россия уверенно реализует машину. One of the things about the Russian military is that they announce these fantastic new weapons, whether it's new Cupid submarine drones or hypersonic missiles, but actually getting them into production beyond the prototype stage is much more difficult. Russia has struggled with this, and despite the enormous amount of money that Putin has put into military modernization since the Russian economy started to recover with higher oil prices over the last 15 to 20 years, the results haven't been spectacular, to put it mildly. There will be some skepticism in naval circles about whether these orders will actually materialize into working ships. Now that we've been keeping our eye on Navy Day in Russia, President Putin has been speaking in St. Petersburg this morning. It's Russia's annual naval review. The author and right and security specialist Putin's already pledged some new ships. But there have been thoughts that some nuclear powers. There was a famous instance of the Victory Day Parade. As we observe today's parade, it looks a it's one of the things about the Russian military. Russia has struggled with this, and despite it's proved quite difficult for the Russian Navy. They had a spectacular disaster with the sinking of the Moskbar, the flagship of the Russian Black Sea Fleet. Today seems to be a PR exercise, and there may be skepticism in naval circles about whether these orders will actually materialize into working ships. When it comes to the war, support for it is broad but shallow in Russia. The propaganda machine claims it's a continuation of the great struggle against the Nazis during 1941-45, and that it's a struggle against the West, which wants to destroy Russia. While this rhetoric works to some extent, Russians aren't naive. They know the war was meant to be quick, but is proving slow, and Ukrainians are fighting back, making the cost mount. If there were a change of tag in Russia, either with Putin declaring victory or some post-Putin leadership saying they'll do things differently, Russians might accept the new line. 